name is Laura Van Espe. I'm a PhD researcher at the Laboratory of Viral Metagenomics at the KU Leuven in Belgium. So today I will uh, show you some results on a study we did in patients with decompensated liver cirrhosis and ACLF or acute and chronic liver failure. You might all have heard about the microbiome, your gut microbiome. So we actually studied the gut virome in these patients, which is the viral part of the microbiome. It mainly consists of viruses that infect bacteria, which are called phages. And so in these patients with decompensated liver cirrhosis, we actually showed that the more severe your disease is, the higher your viral diversity is. So for example, in patients with ACLF, and we also showed that these patients have a shift in the phage composition in terms of their lifestyle. So we see more temperate phages in these patients. And temperate phages are phages that can integrate their genomes into that of their bacterial hosts. And so this higher relative abundance of these phages might be because of an induction of these phages from their integrated state into their extracellular state. And an hypothesis for this could be the high levels of inflammation that are seen in acute and chronic liver failure. And next to that, we also found associations between specific groups of phages and some clinical characteristics. So, for example, we saw a higher relative abundance of Lactobacillus A phages in patients that will develop ACLF in the near future. And these phages were also associated with a higher short-term mortality. Also, Enzocopis B phages were associated with a higher short-term mortality, and these phages were also associated with bacterial infection, which is an important precipitating event and complication of decompensated liver cirrhosis and ACLF. And this finding we were able to validate in an external validation cohort. So this one consisted of almost 100 patients, and we had longitudinal samples for these individuals. And the validation cohort was also almost 100 patients, but only one sample for each patient. So these samples from the original cohort, they were collected in Debrecen, so Hungary. And the validation cohort is from Germany. Thank you. Thank you.